Oh, I guess we're all fine. It's it's fine. It's it's fine. We don't we don't have technical issues or anything. <laughs> We are streaming, we are recording. Hey there guys, I'm Ty3 here. Welcome back. I got I got a little bit of a new hat. My shout out to my uh, my sister-in-law, Angel. Thank you. Thank you for making my hat. I love it. It's a perfect 10. Guys, here we are again. 2022. Um I guess I I guess I have to fix the controller. Anyways, guys, it's 2022. Time for a new Fable Anniversary playthrough. With now Fable Anniversary, I'm actually doing the Fable Anniversary, Fable Anniversary Redux mod. Adds a lot to the game. I've already tested it before. I tested it way, like, basically a year ago. Like, this mod came out right, like, basically right after my uh, my playthrough last year, you know, 2021. And I was just like, fuck, I wish it was out when I did this playthrough. My goal is to play through the game and actually try to play it as fast as I can with this mod. Hopefully, I don't have to grind too much. <laughs> Deep in the forest of Albion, lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Mind always Maybe wandering. Find your sister, will you? Yeah, will you? Sheesh. Came by the Barrowfields gate. Barrowfields, mate. Her a birthday present yet? Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. Okay, what kind of playthrough am I gonna do? Am I gonna be a good, a good boy? Am I gonna be a mean boy? Stupid little idiot! Oh no! Oh, let's get the hell out of here. Gotta go fast. That's that's all that matters. Going fast. <laughs> Come on. Get your miscellaneous items here. I was cheesy. Yeah, they're on my ass. Let's get the chocolates. Let's go. Let's go. The sooner we get through the tutorial, the sooner we can actually test out this mod and see how fucking awesome it is. Yeah. Chocolates. Let's go. Brother, I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is, like you did last year. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. I was standing in this field when something happened, but I can't remember what. Never mind that, though. I'm still waiting for my present. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. Come on, let's go home. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. All right, let's go ruin a childhood and a boy's future. Fuck! All right, let's go. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood-red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets.
Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was them they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior and fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away, his whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. Dad. I probably say this every playthrough I do, but just like the colors that they use to like just 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 make it like eerie and scary, like these flames and Oh, there's the father. Poor bastard. We must leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. you'd have a stronger stomach than that. Come on. <sighs> Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. My name is Maze. And I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs with the girl. You don't look much like hero material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. And at that moment, the boy chose violence. Like, and everyone like just talks shit about you. Like, you're such the underdog. One of our brightest young. Fucking Christ, She's man. In the woods right now. But you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should get some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. He's like, I don't know what's going on. I, he has, probably hasn't had anything to eat. Still some serious tragedy. <laughs> like, go to bed. You got shit to do tomorrow. It's Fucking time beautiful. to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. But that's all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The guildmaster yeah, yeah. is waiting for us in the map room. Uh. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. And again, here's this bitch like, fuck, I, you know, just a whiny little cunt. God. Like. Hmm. Looks like the guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go. I wish that they actually, like, if they, if they ever do a, a legitimate remake, a legitimate, you know, 
reimagining of the original fable right um they need to expand you know the childhood you know stuff like yeah, you know, if someone wants to sit here or whatever, I mean, it could be a great way to level up and, you know, start off the actual beginning of the game. Um, you know, nose will be stronger and stuff. But, like, let's get some extra flavor between, you know, you the hero and Whisper. Um, I remember a buddy of mine a couple years back, I showed him this game, I'm like, here, play it, it's amazing, da da da. He really enjoyed it, and he go he goes, oh shit! Like there's the, the, like a kid's all talking about the twist with uh, Whisper and the hero. And he goes, oh shit! Can you marry her? Is that a good thing? And I'm like, I ain't got to figure it out, dude. He ends up killing her, and goes, that wasn't what I expected at all. You finally here. All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. Get down the ring. Now then. I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. I'm not making much of an impact there, are you? Yeah, we're not gonna worry about that. Equipped. Cool. Cool. Ah, now that's more like it. Yep. I need to keep with the mindset that I'm trying to beat this as fast as I can. I'm not trying to do as much as I can. I'm trying to beat as fast as I can. Um. With how many times I've played this game and beaten every little shit out of it, I should be able to. I'm not sure what my speed run time would be. I'm very curious about that. I think I've basically done it in 10 hours. I could, I could very well shave that down. Like how much, how much can I get done tonight? That's that's a good question. Can I get to Oakville by, by the end of the stream? So much no. You know, I'm not sure if I could cut my time in half, but. Good work, lad. Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Here, I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. Mm. You want more gold? Cool. Yep. The guild was now the boy's life. The memory of the Oakvale flames still scorched his mind, but soon he had no thought other than training, and he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. His days were filled with grueling exercises, the nights with study in the library. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Maze had foreseen. The real training was about to begin. Get out of bed, lazy bones. We were supposed to meet the guildmaster on the other side of the river, but that was an hour ago. We better That's get going. That's different. Oh, because the black and red is supposed to be apprentice or whatever, but the blue and white is supposed to show that you graduated. That's really cool. Do I have the other version of it? Like. Apprentice. Graduate outfit. Oh. That's interesting. That is really interesting. Okay, let's go. And roll. Wait again. Shut the fuck up. You can put that old stick away. Yeah, I know. Alright. Well done. <laughs> Here comes fucking thunder. Are you ready for your yes, 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 yes. yes. The... Yep. Uh, info on the bow, sixty damage. Not terrible. Yeah. Excellent shooting, my lad. Do that in your skill test, and I'll be most impressed. The will. Just the wow. It's time to learn about will powers. Will power. By striking these strong dummies. Cool. Okay. Zap. Zap. Baranagan. Excellent use of magic. Magic. Well, well done. done. 
And continue. Oh, yep, yep. I hope you're ready. Truly. The boy mastered the skills quickly, but there was always more to learn. For years, the guild was his home, his school, and his life. But as time passed, his thoughts returned always to the world outside. The life he had lost, the family that had been torn from him. At last, only the final day of tests remained. Success would mark the end of his training. He would receive the guild seal and be free to forge his own destiny. He would become a hero. Before you graduate, there is one final test you must complete. Cool. <laughs> enough yes quite impressive for a novice cool. let the apprentices approach for many years now you have worked hard to earn yourselves the title of hero today that apprenticeship ends and you go out into the world to do great deeds great deeds that will bring you the gratitude of thousands or strike fear these are dark times. The shadows of Albion are stirring, and strange winds are blowing. Your choices, whether they lead you down the path of good or evil, will change the face of the world. Now, take your guild seals and venture forth as heroes. 